This is Josh, first mate on the AJ Mirwald, bringing you another episode of Science and Sailing. Today, we will be talking about one of the modern positions you can find on a tall ship, the Education Coordinator. Traditionally, tall ships were used for things like transportation, shipping cargo, and warfare. Today, though, those jobs have been taken over by more modern technologies. Instead, many tall ships now focus on education, so we had to create a position that must be filled on board. The Education Coordinator, or EDCO for short, as you may guess, is responsible for overseeing all of the educational programming on board. This includes teaching children, training crew on how to teach, developing and adjusting the curriculum, cleaning and maintaining the educational supplies, keeping track of timing during sales, calling schools before the sale, and maintaining a logbook for the educational activities. In addition to the education-specific work, the EDCO must be able to perform the duties of a regular deckhand, such as operating and maintaining the ship and participating in daily chores. The EDCO often holds an officer's position on board, meaning that he or she may participate in leading watches or making decisions about vessel operations. The education coordinator has to be able to communicate easily with both children and adults, since they teach children and crew members and work closely with teachers and parents. They must be able to give directions, be very organized, and be able to represent the organization in a positive manner. They must be very positive and energetic, and be very knowledgeable about the curriculum of the boat they are working on. Finally, they must be an excellent public speaker. A loud voice doesn't hurt either. Many education coordinators started off their careers as deckhands, and then were promoted to the EDCO position when they gain more experience. With some organizations, however, you may be able to bypass being a deckhand and move straight into the EDCO position, but only if you have significant educational experience already. When do you think that tall ships started hiring education coordinators? What are some challenges that EDCOs might face? Let us know in the comment section below. This has been Josh with Signs and Sailing, bringing the Bayshore to you.